Papua is the largest and easternmost province of Indonesia, comprising most of western New Guinea. Papua is bordered by the nation of Papua New Guinea to the east, and by West Papua Province to the west. Since 2002, Papua Province has special autonomy status, making it a special region. Its capital is Jayapura. It was formerly called Irian Jaya, an earlier West Irian or Irian Bharat, and comprised all of Indonesian New Guinea. In 2002 the current name was adopted and in 2003 West Papua Province was created from western parts of Papua Province. Naming Papua is the official Indonesian and internationally recognized name for the province. During the Dutch colonial era the region was known as part of Dutch New Guinea or Netherlands New Guinea. Since its annexation in 1969, it became known as West Irian or Irian Bharat until 1973, and thereafter renamed Irian Jaya, roughly translated Glorious Irian by the Suharto administration. This was the official name until the name Papua was adopted in 2002. Today, the indigenous inhabitants of this province prefer to call themselves Papuans. The name, West Papua, was adopted in 1961 by the New Guinea Council until the United Nations Temporary Executive Authority UNTEA, transferred administration to the Republic of Indonesia in 1963. West Papua has since been used by Papuans as a self-identifying term, especially by those demanding self-determination, and usually refers to the whole of the Indonesian portion of New Guinea. The other Indonesian province that shares New Guinea, West Irian Jaya, has been officially renamed as West Papua, or Papua Bharat. The entire Western New Guinea is often referred to as West Papua. Internationally, especially among networks of international solidarity with the West Papuan independence movement. Government the province of Papua is governed by a directly elected governor currently Lucas Enembe, and a regional legislature, People's Representative Council of Province of Papua, Dewan Perwakilan Rakyat Papua. A government organization that only exists in Papua is the Papuan People. S. Council, Majelis Rakyat Papua, Papuan People's Council, which was formed by the Indonesian government in 2005 as a coalition of Papuan tribal chiefs, tasked with arbitration and speaking on behalf of Papuan tribal customs. Indonesian sovereignty over Papua dates back to 1969, when Indonesia conducted a referendum, referred to by the Indonesian government as the Act of Free Choice, on the self-determination of the peoples of Papua under an agreement with the United Nations to respect any result. Instead of conducting a democratic referendum amongst the general population, Indonesian security forces forcibly coerced a small number of tribal elders to vote to join Indonesia. Some elders were not even made aware that a referendum was to be conducted beforehand. Nevertheless, the agreement with the UN was nominally upheld, and was recognized by the international community in spite of protests. This intensified the independence movement among indigenous West Papuans, deepening the Papua conflict, which began when the Dutch withdrew from the East Indies in 1963. The conflict has continued to the present, with Indonesian security forces being accused of numerous human rights abuses in their suppression of the independence movement. The Indonesian government maintains tight control over the region, barring foreign journalists or rights monitors from entering, those who do must do so covertly. In 1999 it was proposed to split the province into three government-controlled sectors, sparking Papuan protests. In January 2003 President Megawati Sukarnaputri signed an order dividing Papua into three provinces, Central Irian Jaya, Irian Jaya Tenga, Papua, or East Irian Jaya, Irian Jaya Timur, and West Papua, Irian Jaya Bharat. The formality of installing a local government for Jaraka in Irian Jaya Bharat West took place in February 2003 and a governor was appointed in November. A government for Irian Jaya Tenga, Central Irian Jaya, was delayed from August 2003 due to violent local protests. The creation of this separate Central Irian Jaya province was blocked by Indonesian courts, who declared it to be unconstitutional and in contravention of the Papua's Special Autonomy Agreement. The previous division into two provinces was allowed to stand as an established fact. 
Special autonomy status The province of Papua is one of three provinces to have obtained special autonomy status, the others being Aceh and West Papua. According to Law 21 2001 on Special Autonomy Status, UU No More 21 Tahan 2001 10 Tang Autonomi Kusis Papua, the provincial government of Papua is provided with authority within all sectors of administration, except for the five strategic areas of foreign affairs, security and defense, monetary and fiscal affairs, religion and justice. The provincial government is authorized to issue local regulations to further stipulate the implementation of the special autonomy, including regulating the authority of districts and municipalities within the province. Due to its special autonomy status, Papua province is provided with significant amount of special autonomy funds, which can be used to benefit its indigenous peoples. But the province has low fiscal capacity and it is highly dependent on unconditional transfers and the above-mentioned special autonomy fund, which accounted for about 55% of total revenues in 2008. After obtaining its special autonomy status, in order to allow the local population access to timber production benefits, the Papuan provincial government issued a number of decrees, enabling a timber logging permit for customary communities, which enabled local people to carry out timber extraction in small concessions, 250 to 1,000 hectares, for one year through a community-based or participatory community cooperative. A permit to manage customary forests, which was a timber extraction permit for larger concessions, up to 2,000 hectares, for a maximum of 20 years. Logging companies had to pay compensations to local communities in addition to all other fees and taxes collected by the national government. Administrative divisions As of 2010, following the separation of West Papua Province in 2003, the residual Papua Province consisted of 28 regencies and one autonomous city Kota. these regencies and the city are together subdivided into 385 districts and thence into villages Kelyorahan and Desa. In Papua, as well as in the province of West Papua, Kekamitan are commonly referred to as district. The regencies Kabupaten, and the city Kota, are listed below with their areas and their populations at the 2010 census and according to the latest official, January 2014, estimates. Asterisk the 2005 estimated population of Bhavan de Gaulle Regency is included in the figure quoted for Marauke Regency, from which Bhavan de Gaulle was divided. Hashtag the 2005 estimated population of this regency are included in the figures quoted for the existing regency from which the newer regency was divided in 2007 or 2008. Provincial decentralization history in 2000, the present area of Papua province originally consisted of nine regencies, Biak Numfor, Jayapura, Jayawajaya, Marauke, Mimika, Navir, Paniai, Punchak Jaya, and Yapan Waropan. On 12 November 2002, the following regencies were created Kiram and Sarmi regencies were split from Jayapura Regency, Bintang Mountains, Peguningan Bintan, Tolakara, and Yahukimo regencies were split from Jayawajaya Regency. Asmat, Bhavan de Gaulle and Mapi Regencies were split from Marauke Regency Yapan Waropan Regency was split into Yapan Islands Regency Kapalawan Yapan and Waropan Regency on 8 January 2004, Supiori Regency was split from Biak Numfor Regency. On 15 March 2007, under Law No 19-2007, the following Regencies were created Mambarama Raya Regency was formed from parts of Sarmi and Waropan Regencies Dojiyai Regency was similarly formed from the southern districts of Navir Regency on 4 January 2008. Five other new regencies were created by Home Affairs Minister Martianto who also installed five temporary regents. These five new regencies were Four formerly from part of Jayawajaya Regency Central Mambaramo Regency with five districts, with Kobakma as the regental seat. Created by the Law No. 3 2008, the first regent was David Pagawak. 
Yalimo Regency also has five districts, with Elalim as the regental capital. Created by the law No. 4 2008, the first regent was Elia Ibrahim Lupati. Lani Jaya Regency with 10 districts, with Tiom as the regental capital. Created by the law No. 5 2008, the first regent was Privati Sukartono. N. Duga Regency with 8 districts, with Kenyam as the regental capital. Created by the law No. 6 2008, the first regent was Hans Dorthias. One formerly from part of Punchak Jaya Regency. Punchak Regency also has eight districts, with Alaga as the regental capital. Created by the law No. 7 2008, the first regent was Simon Alam. Within 2008, Intan Jaya and Diyai Regencies were split from Paniyai Regency. Proposed new regencies, cities, and provinces on 25 October 2013 the Indonesian House of Representatives DPR, began reviewing draft laws on the establishment of 57 prospective regencies, cities, and eight new provinces. This included two new provinces to be formed from parts of the existing Papua province and one new province from West Papua province, as well as the creation of 17 new regencies and two new cities independent municipalities. The new regencies will be Moyo, Muara de Gol and Admi Corbe Gili Manawa, Balin Center, Bagaga, Punchak Trikora, Katengban, Akika, Ulimic, Esser Yahukimo Western Mountains, Mombara Hulu, Southwest Yahukimo, East Yahukimo and North Yahukimo Northwest Yapan, East Yapan, Numfor Island and Gandumi Cesarean The new cities will be the municipalities of Marauke and Lemba Baliam, Baliam Valley, the two new provinces from parts of the existing Papua province have recently been approved by Indonesia's House of Representatives, South Papua, and Central Papua Another new province, to be split from West Papua will be Southwest Papua. South Papua the proposed South Papua, Papua Selatan province would cover an area of 119,749 square km, which is rich in natural resources. It will encompass four existing regencies. Asmat, Bhavan de Gaulle, Mapi and Marakind will thus equate closely to the original Marauke Regency prior to the splitting of that entity in 2002. Within the existing regencies, new regencies to be added are the following. Moyo, from Bhavan de Gaulle Regency. Muara de Gaulle and Admi Corbe, both from Mapi Regency, and a new municipality of Marauke City, which is scheduled to be created from Marauke Regency. Central Papua According to a 20 January 2012 report in the Sundarawasa Pos Jakarta, the central government is moving forward with the creation of Central Papua. At that time it was envisaged that the new province would comprise ten existing regencies Supiori, Biak Numfor, Yapan Islands, Waropan, Navir, Dojiyai, Diyai, Intan Jaya, Paniyai, and Mimakatha New Central Papua Province, and the residual Papua Province, would together include the new regencies. First of, for Papua proper, Gili Manawa, from Jayapura Regency, Balin Center, from Lani Jaya Regency and Tolakara Regency Boboga, from Tolakara Regency Punchak Trikora, from Lani Jaya Regency Katengban, from Bintang Mountains Regency Akika, from Jayawajaya Regency, and Ulimic, Esser Yahukimo Western Mountains, Mombara Hulu, Southwest Yahukimo, East Yahukimo and North Yakuhimo, all six from Yahukimo Regency, and a new municipality of Lemba Baliam, Baliam Valley, created from Jayawajaya Regency. And for Central Papua, Northwest Yapan and East Yapan, both from Yapan Islands Regency, Numfor Island, from Biak Numfor Regency, and Gandumi Cesare, from Waropan Regency. Jayapura City The city of Jayapura also has the status of an autonomous city, equal to a regency. 
It was founded on 7 March 1910 as Hollandia and as the capital. Since Indonesian administration the name of the city has been changed to Kotaburu, then to Sukarnapura before its current name, Jayapura. Jayapura is also the largest city of Papua province, with a small but active tourism industry. It is built on a slope overlooking the bay. Sundarawasa University UNCEN campus at Abapura houses the University Museum where some of the Asmat artifacts collected by Michael Rockefeller is stored. Both Tanjung Ria Beach, near the market at Hamadi, site of the 22nd of April 1944 Allied invasion during World War II, and the site of General Douglas MacArthur's World War II headquarters at IFAR Gunning have monuments commemorating the events. Geography A central east-west mountain range dominates the geography of the island of New Guinea, over 1,600 kilometers 1, miles in total length. The western section is around 600 kilometers 400 miles long and 100 kilometers 60 miles across. The province contains the highest mountains between the Himalayas and the Andes, rising up to 4,884 meters 16,024 feet high, and ensuring a steady supply of rain from the tropical atmosphere. The tree line is around 4,000 meters 13,000 feet elevation and the tallest peaks contain permanent equatorial glaciers, increasingly melting due to a changing climate. Various other smaller mountain ranges occur both north and west of the central ranges. Except in high elevations, most areas possess a hot humid climate throughout the year, with some seasonal variation associated with the northeast monsoon season. The southern and northern lowlands stretch for hundreds of kilometers and include lowland rainforests, extensive wetlands, savanna grasslands, and expanses of mangrove forest. The southern lowlands are the site of Lorentz National Park, also a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The province's largest river is the Mambaramo located in the northern part of the province. The result is a large area of lakes and rivers known as the Lakes Plains region. The Baliam Valley, home of the Dani people, is a tableland 1,600 meters 5, feet above sea level in the midst of the central mountain range. Punchak Jaya, also known by its Dutch colonial name, Karstens Pyramid, is a limestone mountain peak 4,884 meters 16, feet above sea level. It is the highest peak of Oceania. Ethnic groups The following are some of the most well-known ethnic groups of Papua. The Yei pronounced Ye, are sometimes known as the Jei, Je, Yei Nan people. There are approximately 2,500 speakers of the Yei language. 40% ethno-religionists animistic tribal religion 60% Catholics and other Christians blended with animistic beliefs and customs, the Yei language is believed to have two dialects observed by a Wycliffe Sill language survey in 2001. At home the Yei people speak their own language but use Indonesian for trade, wider communication and at school. Most Yei are literate in Indonesian. There are elementary schools in each village. About 10 to 30 percent of children continue in middle school. Very few go to high school. The nearest high school is in Marauke City. They live primarily by hunting, fishing, and gardening short and long-term crops in the lowlands. The Yei diet mainly consists of rice, vegetables, fish and roasted sago. With their land at an altitude of less than 100 meters above sea level, the Yei people can best be accessed by vehicle on the road from Marauke or by motorized canoe up the Maro River. There is no airstrip or airplane access other than float plane which is currently available from Marauke through MAF by about a 15-minute flight to Torre. The Pu and Bupal villages have a clinic but people still use traditional medicines. There is very little infrastructure in the area, no telephones or toilets. At night electricity is run from a generator. There are single side band radios SSBs in Bupal, Tanis, Pu, and Arambu villages, mainly used by the police and military force. Most villages get their drinking water from the Maro River, but some get it from wells or by collecting rain. Demographics The population of Papua province has a fertility rate of 2.9 children per woman The population grew from the 1.9 million recorded in the 2000 Indonesia census, to 2.9 million as recorded by the 2010 census, and is officially estimated to be at about 3.5 million in 2014. Since the early 1990s Papua has had the highest population growth rate of all Indonesian provinces at over 3% annually. 
This is partly a result of birth rates, but mainly due to migration from other parts of Indonesia. While indigenous Papuans formed the near totality of the population in 1961, they are now roughly 50% of the population, the other half being composed of non-Papuan migrants coming from other parts of Indonesia. An overwhelming percentage of these migrants came as part of a government-sponsored transmigration program. The densest population center, other than the large coastal cities that house Indonesian bureaucratic and commercial apparatus, is located in and around the town of Wamina in the Baliam Valley of the Central Highlands. Religion According to the 2010 census, 83.15% of the Papuans identified themselves as Christian with 65.48% being Protestant and 17.67% being Roman Catholic, 15.88% of the population was Muslim and less than 1% were Buddhist or Hindu. There is also substantial practice of animism, the traditional religion for many Papuans, with many blending animistic beliefs with other religions such as Christianity. Economy In 2011, Papuan caretaker Governor Siamsal Arif Rivai claimed Papua's forests cover 42 million hectares with an estimated worth of Rp.700 trillion $78 billion, and that if the forests were managed properly and sustainably, they could produce over 500 million cubic meters of logs per annum. The Grassberg Mine, the world's largest gold mine and third largest copper mine, is located in the highlands near Punchak Jaya, the highest mountain in Papua. Ecology The island has an estimated 16,000 species of plant, 124 genera of which are endemic. Papua's known forest fauna includes, marsupials including possums, wallabies, tree kangaroos, couscouses, other mammals including the endangered long-beaked echidna, bird species such as birds of paradise, cassowaries, parrots, and cockatoos, the world. S. Longest Lizards Papua Monitor, and the world's largest butterflies, the waterways and wetlands of Papua are also home to salt and freshwater crocodile, tree monitors, flying foxes, osprey, bats and other animals, while the equatorial glacier fields remain largely unexplored. Protected areas within Papua province include the World Heritage Lorentz National Park, and the Wasser National Park, a Ramsar wetland of international importance. In February 2006, a team of scientists exploring the Foja Mountains, Sar Army, discovered new species of birds, butterflies, amphibians, and plants, including possibly the largest flowered species of rhododendron. Ecological threats include logging induced deforestation, forest conversion for plantation agriculture, including oil palm, smallholder agricultural conversion, the introduction and potential spread of alien species such as the crab eating macaque, which preys on and competes with indigenous species, the illegal species trade, and water pollution from oil and mining operations. See also Azmat Swamp List of earthquakes in Indonesia List of rivers of Papua Papua conflict References King, Peter, West Papua since Suharto, Independence, Autonomy, or Chaos University of New South Wales Press, 2004, ISBN 0 86840 676 7. External links Official website Languages and ethnic groups of Papua Province, SIL Ethnologue